Welcome to another vlog. This is Becoming Drives with Clint. <laughs> so I read a really good article this morning by the CEO of Strava, James Quarles, talking about work-life balance. And I felt like I was reading an article about myself, just his priorities and his values. And so I wanna talk about that for a few minutes, reminding us how important it is to compartmentalize our lives and really live with intention so he was talking about when he's at work he wants to be fully at work and when he's with his family he wants to be fully with his family and you know how important it is to not let those kind of bleed into each other just to live with boundaries that's one thing I've really been thinking about lately is living with boundaries so I thought it was cool how you know he, he it's a CEO who basically gets up every morning and runs and on Wednesdays he has a, a block training session with his employees about he said about 30 to 40 of the employees get together and do a run in intervals and then they go out and get a healthy lunch after that and another thing about about having work life work life balance for me is not only living with intention but also developing you know schedules and, and, and uh, you know like I, I I'm pretty regimented with my schedule not everybody can live like that some people are more you know just free form and, and feel better living kind of in the moment I, I really schedule things and so my lunch rides have become so important to me I ride at lunch about three days a week I'm gonna ride today at lunch I even keep a bike at work and I realize I have it really good with my work situation having trails 30 miles of mountain bike trails literally 30 uh, 10 meters from my office door and then having showers at work and a place to keep my bike so I you know I realize not everybody has it that good but if I didn't if I if riding at lunch was hard for me to do and I couldn't do it then I would commute to work I actually don't commute to work that much for a couple reasons one is because I like riding in the middle of the day but more importantly just with my kids their schedule I'm always like going somewhere right after work or you know having to go over to the school maybe during the day every once in a while so I don't commute that that much but if I if I did not have the ability to ride at lunch I would definitely commute but also you know as as cyclists who either you know commute to work or ride at lunch we're different like we're I'm the only one that does this I used to have a guy that worked with me who would run at lunch and there were people who go down to the gym but people who you know put on spandex and go for a ride at lunch it's it's we're different and you have to kind of realize that CEOs who commute on a bicycle to work like this guy James Corals uh, Strava CEO he said uh, he takes a train in and then rides his bike in and commutes in and I've read about other CEOs I'm really inspired by people who don't let a position dictate their lifestyle you know if they want to commute to work if you're a CEO or whatever and you want to commute to work don't worry about it don't worry about what people think about you yeah it's we are we are a different breed of people uh, you know endurance athletes and you know honestly you know I, I know people all over the world watch my videos but in America if you eat really healthy and you exercise a lot you're different I, it's sad it's really sad but you're just a different breed and and, and so to, to live that lifestyle of right priorities uh, you, yeah you're going to be different than the people around you but that's just that's the way it is and you know I have a stand-up desk a few people at work are getting stand-up desks they're becoming more popular I don't use it like to, you know all day at work but I you know I'm on a schedule when I raise and lower it typically and you know just things like that I sit on an exercise ball that's different <laughs> when people I have a nice office chair right next to me and I don't use it because it hurts my back so I guess the point of this vlog is one read the article because it's really good I'm gonna put the link in the description below so check that out I thought it was really really well written and you know like the guy's a family man and a CEO and he has his exercise priorities and he eats real healthy 
So all the things that are important to me, uh, again, read the article, but also, uh, you know, live with intention, set boundaries. It's important for you to be in the moment. You know, it kind of has to do with that work-life balance video that I made, or I forgot what I titled it, but I'll link that below too. I did that a year or two ago. But so live with intention and don't be afraid to be different. If your priorities make you different than other people, then that's that's just the way it is. If they don't like it, that's their problem. That's not yours. Uh, you live with uh, with your priorities in mind. And family. Family is so important to me. I took a day off work two days ago and went to my kid's uh, district tennis tournament. And it was a sacrifice. You know, I burned a vacation day, but... It was important to me. It was important to them. It's something that they'll always remember. So family's important too. All right. That's it for today's vlog. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you.